We were told once you get here, it will be proven without a doubt. You'll be able to see that she contributed in her own death. Sandra Bland, the Naperville woman who died in a Texas jail back in 2015, is the subject of a new documentary. Bland was found hanged after a controversial traffic stop and arrest. Bland's mother and sisters, who are all featured in the film, hope it helps to bring about change. CBS 2's Dana Kozlov spoke with Bland's oldest sister about the documentary and life now. Prophecy, though, that she would yes. help change the world. Yes. As Shantae Needham stares at the poster for the documentary about her sister Sandra Bland, you can almost feel her emotion through her silence. It's bittersweet. And for this oldest sibling, it's still painful to relive Bland's 2015 death and the questions that linger. To be honest with you, I don't ever think I will have peace because I still do not know what happened to my sister. Say Her Name, being shown at Chicago's Music Box Theater, gives the audience a glimpse into Bland's life, her activism, and her spirit. What would you want them to know about her, about her spirit? That she was bold, she was smart, she was sassy, she was the best trombone player, she was God-fearing. She loved people. She loved helping people. Or I will remove you. It also tries to unravel what happened between the time the 28-year-old Bland was arrested during this Texas arrest, traffic stop. Right you say, are under arrest. I'm under arrest for what? And her death three days later in a Waller County jail cell, ruled a suicide by asphyxiation. The way they choose to phrase it is where she was did not have cameras. If it were true, then I think we should have been able to see the evidence proving that that was their truth. Looking at the camera too. Above all, Needham hopes this film makes people think about how police interact with civilians, especially civilians of color. I just hope people leave feeling inspired after watching this documentary to activate what's already in them to make a change. Shante Needham says she still cries every day, but she's picked up her sister's activism torch and says she continues to meet with families who've experienced police brutality and violence in their lives. In the newsroom, Dana Kozlov, CBS 2 News. Thank you, Dana. And the officer who arrested Bland was ultimately fired, and Bland's family was awarded almost $2 million from a wrongful death lawsuit that came with guarantees of procedural changes. Say Her Name will be shown again on Sunday and Tuesday with a question and answer segment after Tuesday's screening.